This is our infant model, and all infants have what is known as a fontanelle or a soft spot atop their head that looks something like this. It is very elastic, and the underlying intracranial pressure can be seen through the fontanelle. The intracranial pressure is essentially something we all have, and all infants have, uh, that is the pressure that is surrounding the brain tissue. However, it can rise in certain cases, and if left untreated, it can have serious consequences. The reason this is important is because current techniques of measuring uh, pressure inside infants are not very good. They are, they're either way too invasive, or uh, not accurate enough. So this is our device. This is the reusable portion of the device, and this would be a one-time purchase for the hospital. This is the disposable portion. This is how it would come, and each patient would have one of these when they're being used. It can last at least seven days. It can stay on the patient's head and continuously measure the intracranial pressure for seven days. And so we would place it on top of the, the baby's fontanelle. We envisioning this being used uh, in babies that have had a traumatic accident, you know, they maybe they get into a car crash or some, some sort of fall. Um, if they come into the hospital, then doctors will be able to measure their intracranial pressure and make sure that everything is going on correctly and they're, they're, they have, you know, they don't get permanent brain damage or they don't get seizures in the future um, or to make sure that they take adequate action uh, before things get too, too risky.